What's going on guys, Ford Brothers here for another exciting video of 2022. Delivery. It's a delivery video and um, I don't know what the title of this video is gonna be is, uh, but like we said- It's gonna be whatever we just bought, so. Yeah, whatever, the, I don't know what the title is, but whatever it is, you guys are probably gonna find out. Um, this is the car that we mentioned, what, two videos ago? Yeah, so my, only yeah, only two, two ago, people yeah. on Instagram like slid up and said you guys bought a new car. We didn't tell them what it was. Yeah, that, but, mean, that means whoever people were watching the video probably just skimmed over. Yeah, you guys, you skimmed over the video. You guys weren't watching videos. You, you ain't watching our videos. Oh, but we bought this car like two, three weeks ago. Um, it's a rare car. It's about to be delivered here in the I next see, we, twenty we minutes. We didn't actually plan on buying this. So I just I was always search for different cars, and I, we came across this. It was a good deal, and it had, it had some goodies on it. It had some rare mods on it that you know made the car more valuable, and it was one of those deals where you just kind of can't pass up. So, so we bought it. It's about to show up here any minute from uh, Michigan, and yeah. uh, it's and freezing uh, out here. it's freezing. <laughs> I think it's it was like negative eight this morning, so it's like five degrees now. So we're gonna go ahead and wait, and uh, as soon as it gets here, we're gonna go ahead and continue filming. All right, Matt, looks like the truck just got here. There she is. Oh man. Oh man. Rent tech. Evo wheels. You think Matt's sick? Huh? Looks pretty good. Pretty good. Right, underneath it looks pretty good. Huh? Take a picture of it, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. No, no major leaks that I see. I see it looks pretty good, huh? Yeah, take a picture of it, make it look good. Oh, yeah. Start up with the Rent Tech. Yeah. I'm back on, pulled in the driveway. I literally can't even put my hands. Look at that red tech exhaust, baby. Oh, yeah. Let the Amazon Prime guy go. Can get the package delivered. Oh man, this thing is sick. Let's take a quick look outside real fast in the sun. Love the color. For for anyone that doesn't know, these are the actual Evo wheels that were on the 190E uh, Evo Evo 2. They say actually on the build sheet actually says Evo 2 Sport Wheels. All right, guys, setting out in that cell over here. We're going to get gas because the gas light's on. Yeah, the gas light is on. I don't know if you can see. Matt's, it's, it's so much shade over here, but yeah, so you get the point. We're at the pool in the garage to get a better look at it because it's too cold outside. But That's why I love that snare wall. It's got your typical wood cracks on it. Yeah, these are all cracked, but... Boy, this seat's all jacked up over here. Let me climb it back a little bit. Well, we've been in an R129 in a while. Yeah, it's been a long time since we were in an R129. Boy, this is very small compared to uh, I say it's RSI. Tiny. Wow. All right, guys, we just pulled that cell in the garage because the battery on the camera died because it's literally five degrees outside. It's freezing, yeah. It's actually, it's, it's literally so cold we couldn't even think to even go over the car outside. So we put it in the garage, it's 80 degrees. So uh, I'll go ahead and film and Mac and uh, show you guys the car. Let's go take a look. Actually, we'll just give you guys a uh, quick overview, I guess. Yeah, a quickie, overview. a little quickie. I say the car is really it's a mess right now, but. Uh, yeah. Give us some basic facts. 97, right? Well, I mean, they already know that. We told them already. 97, that's for higher, 40th anniversary, Red and Tech. Um, one of 500, I believe, one of 250 in the United States. Yeah, we've heard people say that there's only 250 anniversary cars in the US. We don't know yet. They only um, came in this color, this spec, yeah, these this wheels. Spec. I don't know how much you want to show them now because the car, it needs cleaned up. It's pretty nasty. Some interior. I say there's not really much to show them. Now. Obviously, we got yeah. the Evo wheels that came on the car factory. Rent tech brakes, those need exhaust, rent tech air box. Uh, we believe it's got to be rent tech tuned, also. Yeah, because I mean, that's good. No, but nobody does all the brakes and tune exhaust and doesn't do, I mean, uh, you know, intake and what the works and maybe tune, it's maybe it's a 6.0, huh? I don't know, definitely scoops. What the pop the hood, but yeah, obviously, it's uh, it's really dirty. It came on open, open trailer. Um, yeah. you know, it needs a little, a little TLC work, but I see, we're gonna, we're gonna let me show you, that. let me show you that exhaust. Or there, look at that. 
we're gonna make some baby. videos. We're gonna make some videos of us doing some uh, restoration work on this. It needs a new. The headliner needs replaced inside the roof here. Maybe recondition the seats. I think we're gonna redo the seats because this one over here has got the tip over. The wheels there. part need a little thing. I don't know. We'll see. What, we'll see what we'll do. Yeah, but I say that's pretty much it. I said we just call, we just contacted Rentec. Uh, down in Florida, and they actually don't have any records of this car because they never do. They, they appa apparently, uh, with Rentec, anything that was done prior to 2007, they have zero records on. So, yeah. and uh, what, we gonna show up to Angel Fest. Uh, I'll say for next so next video. Yeah. But if, if you saw, if you follow us on Instagram, I see the whole party's cleaned up before we do. I say if you follow us on Instagram, you already saw the little teaser of the intake yeah. box. It has the original uh, 90s intake box. So this was definitely done in the late 90s or very, very early 2000s. Yeah, so we're gonna try to find, find out some more information on the Rentec side of this car if we can. If not, I guess. It doesn't really matter because it's, it's still a special car. It's still Rentec. It doesn't matter if Rentec puts it on or, or who puts it on. Yeah, they, that's what they told us. Yeah, they said yeah. doesn't. Back in the day, it's all like you know, oh, it wasn't done at Rentec facility. It was I done in it, Naples, I think, I, though. I see, but does, it doesn't matter. Yeah. If, with, with the guys on the phone, is it doesn't matter if they put it on or if you had your local, if you bought the parts and had a local mechanic. It's still a Rentec on. car. It's still all the Rentec. It's not like any apparently. Car. It's not like an AMG where you, if you bought an E500 and threw all the E5 stuff on, then called yeah. it E5, which is not. Because at the end of the day, it's still a 500, but it has all the Rentec. Yeah, that's what the guy at Rentec said. He said, if it's got the Rentec stuff, it's yeah. a Rentec car because that's just the it's way not, it was. I mean, it should add uh, quite a bit of value to the car. You know, take a little quick over here. The Rentec stuff is pretty desirable. Are they supposed to have these these clear lights? I'm pretty no, sure no. these look like ass. These, these aren't original. You can tell. They're, uh, are, that's cracked too, I think. Yeah, you can tell they're not even Mercedes or junk. They're all broke. Yeah, so we definitely got some work to do to the car, but uh, obviously we're gonna document all of our videos, so I think that's pretty much it for this one because before we give you guys a full in-depth review, we're gonna drive the car some more and get some more impressions of it. I mean, we'll get it cleaned up for you guys, right? We're gonna clean up. It's not really presentable right now. It's driving me nuts. It's filthy. But it looks good. This color, I'll tell you what, this color out in the sun Actually, with the snow. We've never seen one of these in person. No, actually. we've never seen it. The only, the no, only, not an anniversary car. No, the only anniversary car that we ever seen was the 320, the, that blue, where they, they were made all blue. Yeah, but this color, I mean, in the garage, it's hard to tell, but in the sun, it looks really And it's, nice. it's all dusty. It's very dusty yeah. right now. Yeah. But tell you what, outside? It's called, um, does it know? Oh man, I think what it's called. I just ordered the paint for it too. The Zigno Mika or something? Yeah. The, cashmere, somebody, I don't know. Oh no, it's in tears, cashmere. Does, say, somebody called it. I'll tell you right now, let me see. There's like a couple different names for it. Someone calls it the Zigno Rare, some call it the Zigno Mika or something. Um, on the what's on? Chris Chrisman Red. The Zigno Chrisman Red Metallic. Chris Chrisman. Chrisman. Oh. Crimson, Crimson. That's what it is, Crimson. Crimson. Yeah. yeah, Crimson. The Zigno say, Crimson Red. It definitely needs, it's gonna need some polishing because you're good about sorrels over here. So, but yeah, we're gonna get this car looking good. There's a Florida car, Michigan car. I say, you yeah. wanna show them this little special in the Trunkle Fest? So there's a couple of things like we said we bought the sight on scene and they and the dealership we kind of kind of just wanted to hurt. I would say that there, we got a really good deal on the car. So those we didn't want to ask much questions. We just kind of want to take it. One of those deals where you don't want to ask questions, you just want to take in whatever you get. Shoot them a low ball offer and then you take it and run. Yeah, exactly. Well, another fun thing you, people probably don't know is that these uh, anniversary cars they didn't come with badges on. Yeah, factory badge elite on these. Yeah, they didn't come with badges. I feel like it needs a Rentec badge though. I say my third Rentec badge on there. But anyways, so um, we opened up the trunk. We're right off the bat. It came with. Two car, Two car covers, which I think this is the original Mercedes, which I believe might be for the hardtop. Is it? I don't know. It looks too. It has to be for the hardtop. It's too small. It's too small. And then it came with a nice little number right here, a little indoor car cover, a little softy right here, softy like you, Matt. Huh? Yeah. It's Soft. A, this is Mercedes right hey, there. Yeah, look at that. I, I, th I believe, yeah, like you said, that's part for the, the yeah, it has to be. But sadly, it does not have the stand, but that's okay. No stand. Matt, you get your Mustang shirt on. You're supposed to be wearing a Mercedes. Oh, Matt, sorry, man. But anyways, um. So we opened up the trunk. We found those two things laying. I say it has the original 40th anniversary uh, manual booklet with, I'm that's not going to open Yeah, it. you guys know what that looks like, All right? All the manuals are in there. Brand new battery. So they, we have to put this little, this right yeah, here back. it has a new battery to put the cover on. It has the windscreen. That's, that, we weren't expecting any of this, by the way. This yeah, is all new stuff. So and what it also has is, which it makes it, in my opinion, makes it worth everything. This, this car is, it has the original 40th anniversary formats. Which are like extremely, extremely rare to find. I say extremely rare to find to see these. And they're both in good condition. They should be yeah. clean because it looks like the people at the dealership screwed them up. But Look I'll, at this. Let me pull it over I here. I say they're both here. We've had this car, we bought this car like two, three weeks ago. And me and Matt, we've literally been looking on all the forms to try to find these floor mats. Most of the car, most of the cars that have sold, uh, most of these anniversary cars that sold on Bring a Trailer, cars and whatever, you know, online, they don't have these floor mats. So the fact that this car has these floor mats, yeah, and yeah. we didn't even know about it. Yeah, so we didn't know about it. Plus, the other thing too is it has the, uh, it has the, the original, well, I guess these are originals, but it also has the, the original R129 regular floor mats. Yeah, it has the regular floor mats too. The regular Mercedes ones, which also need clean, they're nasty, but. Yeah. Yeah. So obviously, you guys can see it's got the wood steering wheel. That's a SL600 steering wheel that they put in these. So yeah, I say all the anniversary cars got that wood. All the anniversary 500. I think it's the Zigno wood too. They're all spec the same way. That's what it sounds like. Yeah, it's the Zigno wood, the Zigno steering wheel from the 600, the Zigno paint. 
Cosworth Evo wheels. Well, the steering wheel's not unique to the 600. It, it, it was also an uh, option on the 500. Was it? Yeah. Well, you don't see them. Yeah, yeah. I got, but yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it, Matt, right? Let me see. Yeah. Anything else? Go over to the car, huh? Uh, it's enough for this video. This, this is enough. All right, guys. That's it for this video. I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys are excited for this. You're going to see yeah. a lot of videos on it. You're going to see us on Instagram. I don't really should... know why we keep buying projects. We keep we buying projects. This. We bought the... We're supposed to do a build on the truck and on the Mustang. This, this, is, what is, this is the... The Kazi the has been getting the process. We got problems. For, I don't know how long. We bought four cars since May. Four cars. Ford E, the Mustang, the truck, and now this. Yeah. And matter of fact, we this is the second car in two weeks that we bought. We bought the truck two weeks ago. We just bought this. Yeah. Well, in all fairness, our so sister she lives out in Columbus. She hasn't even been home, and we bought two cars since last time she was home. I say, in all fairness, <laughs> we weren't expecting to buy it. This is one of those deals where we, we, we weren't in the truck either. I say we weren't in the market for this. We just saw them a low ball, and we were out just for the hell of it. I got wish yeah. them a low ball, and they took it. So I think it's time to start selling cars. What do you think? Yeah, I said we're gonna start selling some stuff. Maybe hit us some offers in a couple of days. Yeah, throw some offers. We'll see you guys next video.